Well, this year at NAB, we are showing Flame on the Cloud. So Flame is a visual effects, conform, color grading environment where you can you know, do all the big visual effects spots, advertising we see on screen, and also television program uh, and film. So Flame this year is turning, is turning 30 years. So came up in 1992. Starting with the big supercomputer from HGI, went to the Linux operating system on PC boxes, and went to the Mac platform. And this year, well, we are on the cloud. So we spent the last two years working with our friends at AWS, uh, evaluating technology, deploying Flame, but not only Flame, but Flame Assist and Flare, in a work group environment where you have uh, remote rendering with Burn, we have high speed storage with Weka IO, we work with great partners like Arch Platform to create you know, a nice production environment on the cloud, which provides you not only power, because the flame artists who came to the show were able to play with the, the control, control panel, the tablet, and really not feel a difference between an on premise offering or the cloud, which is quite impressive. Uh, we are using uh, NVIDIA graphic card on the cloud. We have a work group environment. We can do all these things very easily now. So if you want to uh, reduce or augment capabilities of your group, well, with the cloud, you can do that. You, can want, you want to add storage, you want to decrease storage, or you want to take pause for one or two weeks, well, you can do it with the cloud. And at the end of the day, it's like you know, science fiction to be able to do these things. But we are happy to come back to NAB this year and to show this magic with our products. We are in the content production uh, part of the AWS uh, boot at NAB, and this is Flame. And Flame, uh, here we have a sequence which has been conformed from an FCP XML coming from a, a creative editorial system. And Flame is all about, you know, creating the last bits at the end of the project. So the editorial has been done, so we are doing finishing, meaning all the magic, the color, the VFX, the beauty work, and we give all the option because as you know, a creative very often will change their mind, and that, that's fine. I mean, with Flame, you can do that. So here, I'm using my tablet to really go fast in the software, and if I want to do some color work, I can use my tangent panel on the side to do that. Here, I'm gonna show you a very cool feature, which is named uh, image segmentation, right? So from our image effect, which is our color grading environment, as you can see, I have here lift them again. I can use the log control or the scene in here, depending on your content, your footage, your deliverables. I can work on my primaries very easily here with my multi ports. I have a multi, multi viewer environment here. So, but what I want to show you is something very cool because we all have to do a beauty work. We have to make the talent, you know, looking nice. Uh, and for that, I'm going to use, I'm going to use a, a, a selective here, which is a secondary. Uh, and on that, Instead of doing a key or masking, I'm gonna use a semantic here. And we've added over the year uh, many technologies uh, on top of machine learning. So we are using you know, uh, the technology of all the research about machine learning that uh, a lot of uh, uh, industries and applications have implemented. But you use, we use that in a nice way where we can in fact isolate body parts. So here I have human face and I can, in fact, isolate the, the skin, the eyes, and if I were to look at my mat here, as you can see, I have done nothing at all. So I just press a button. I didn't have to do rotoscopy. I mean, creating shapes, do tracking. So here, I isolated the skin of the model, so I can go back to uh, my color uh, engine, and then I can add some saturation here, some gain, some saturation. So that means I can easily build on top with multiple secondaries, but again, no roto work, no tracking required. You can uh, modify that with animation, keyframes and time. And at the end of the day, well, if you can save time on not having to roto or ask another artist to do this work for you, well, again, the creative in the suite are able to say, okay, so I like this thing, but can you try that? Well, then the iteration, the try, reset, and do it again is only a fun game, right? So this is what you can do with our products, Flame Family products. Uh, on AWS Cloud at NAB 2022. If you want to learn more, come to our website, autodesk.com slash flame. You're going to be able to see all the product offering, all the licensing options, all the documentation to deploy Flame in the cloud, and everything you need to know is there.